Hey, thank you for following the First Middle Church of Christ. We're really glad to have you. and Hope you're having a wonderful day out there today. I want to thank all those who have subscribed to our channel. We're going to really greatly appreciate that. You know, here at the uh, First Middle Church of Christ, this is where faith and fellowship come together in a powerful expression of worship. We invite you in, to engage with us beyond the pews and follow us on our journey on our social media. Connect with us like on our social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. To stay updated on our messages. And we encourage you to subscribe to our YouTube channel. That way you can experience our, our inspiring messages. And be sure to pass along to your family and friends. And we have some great messages and topics that can help you and encourage you in your walk with the Lord. Your generous donations play a crucial role in supporting our ministry, enabling us to continue spreading the message of love, hope, and unity. Your contributions help us reach more people, supports our community, and even creates meaningful experiences for all who seek spiritual fulfillment. Join us online, subscribe, and consider making a donation to support our mission as we strive to make a positive impact in the lives of others. I want to talk to you today a little bit about uh, Psalms 23. I'm going to do a expository on Psalms 23. And this is a beloved passage in the Bible that is cherished by many Christians. And the New Living Translation of the Bible presents this passage in a contemporary and accessible language, making it easy for modern readers to connect with its meaning. Now, here is the expository of Psalms 23 using the NLT version. In Psalms 23, verses 1 through 6, it reads, The Lord is my shepherd. I have all that I need. He lets me rest in green meadows. He leads me besides peaceful streams. He renews my strength. He guides me along right paths, bringing honor to his name. Even when I walk through the darkest valley, I will not be afraid, for you are close beside me, your rod and your staff. They protect me and comfort me. You prepare a feast for me in the presence of my enemies. You honor me by anointing my head with oil. My cup overflows with blessings. Surely your goodness and unfailing love will pursue me all the days of my life, and I will live in the house of the Lord forever. Now, the Lord is my shepherd. In Psalms 23, the metaphor of God as a shepherd is significant uh, to the teachings of the church. As a shepherd cares for and tends to its flock, God provides guidance, protection, and nourishment to his people. Now, Christians believe, in, believe that God's role has the ultimate shepherd who leads, nurtures, and watches over his flock with love and compassion. This imagery reflects the, um, the intimate relationship between God and his people, emphasizing the personal care and attention that God provides. Members of the church find comfort in the belief that God, as their shepherd, knows them individually and is deeply invested in their well-being. Rest and renewal. This imagery of resting in green meadows and being led beside peaceful streams in Psalms 23 conveys a sense of spiritual nourishment, renewal, and tranquility. This imagery is deeply meaningful to Christians as it symbolizes the rest and rejuvenation that believers find in their relationship with God. The teachings of the church emphasizes the needs for spiritual nourishment and renewal through prayer study of the scriptures, and fellowship with her fellow believers. The passage highlights God's role in providing a sense of peace and restoration, which is essential for the spiritual well-being of his people. Guidance and Righteousness Psalms 23 speaks of God guiding his people along the right paths, bringing honor to his name, the theme resonates strongly with the teachings of the church, which emphasizes the importance of following God's guidance and living a righteous life in accordance with his will. Christians believe in the moral and spiritual direction that God provides through his word and through the indwelling of the Holy Spirit. The passage underscores the significance of aligning one's life with God's will and finding fulfillment in honoring his name through righteous living comfort in difficult times. The imagery of walking through the darkest valley or walking through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil because of God's close presence offers profound comfort and assurance to believers. This aspect of Psalms 23 is especially relevant to the teachings which emphasizes God's consistent care and constant care and support for his people 
even in the midst of trials and challenges and tribulation. This passage conveys the idea that God's presence and protection are unwavering, providing believers with the strength and courage to navigate through difficult circumstances. We find solace in the belief that God's loving presence and guidance sustains them in times of adversity. Blessings and abundance. Psalms 23 portrays God as a generous and abundant provider, preparing a feast and overflowing cup for his people. This imagery reflects the teachings regarding God's boundless blessings and provision for his followers. The passage underscores the concept of God's abundant grace, love, and blessings that's bestowed upon his people. Members of the church find encouragement in the belief that God's provision exceeds their need and that his blessings are a source of joy and gratitude. The internal dwelling with God. Now, the promise of living in the house of the Lord forever in Psalms 23 encapsulates the hope of eternal life and the assurance of being in God's presence for all eternity in the teachings of the promise of the eternal life and hope of dwelling in the presence of God for eternity and uh, they are foundational beliefs. Now, Christians find profound comfort and assurance uh, in the assurance of their future with God from the suffering that are filled with his glory. Now, the promise underscores the ultimate fulfillment of God's redemptive plan for his people, uh, where they will experience the fullness of his presence and enjoy everlasting communion with him. The passage in Psalms 23 serves as a reminder to members of the ultimate destiny is to dwell in the eternal presence of God, where they will find perfect peace, joy, and fulfillment. Now, in conclusion, Psalms 23 in the NLT version of the Bible provides a rich and multifaceted portrayal of God's care, guidance, and provision of his people, which aligns with the teachings and beliefs of the church. The passage offers deep comfort, assurance, and hope, emphasizing the intimate relationship between God and his followers. Christians find in Psalms 23 a profound representation of their faith when it's themed of God's loving grace guidance and a promise of eternal life in his presence.